Hi, uh, Paul Gardner Stephen from the Civil Project here, and just uh, that will give you a sneak peek of what's coming up in the uh, the next release of the uh, the Civil Mesh software. So uh, down here we have a, a couple of phones running the uh, the latest version uh, from our nightly builds. This is probably even a, a uh, three o'clock in the afternoon build, in fact. And uh, what we'll do is we'll uh, start a phone call between the two. Uh, when I actually hit the answer button, so we're hello everybody. You should be able to hopefully hear me through there. Uh, we still have a little bit of latency due to, uh, to Android. But what we really want to look at today is uh, here. Have a look at the, uh, the output from top. And my apologies if this camera is uh, useless at getting a, uh, an in-focus picture. But uh, uh, we'll get a, a screen capture to, to help show this as well. The, uh, the CPU load uh, for that phone call on uh, the Huawei IDEOS X1 phones, which are amongst the slowest Android phones known to man on the market at the moment, uh, the CPU load is still below 40%, about 20% for the Java code, about 20% uh, for the, uh, the Serval D, Serval Mesh uh, core itself, uh, which is really pleasing, particularly given that there's actually really high grade uh, encryption uh, on that call. The entire call is uh, you know, encrypted end to end in both directions, and we still have the, uh, the CPU load uh, very low. So. Uh, that's really pleasing to know that uh, the, the NACL crypto library that we're using uh, is up to the task even on these phones. And uh, so we ought to look forward to, uh, to secure voice calls on the next version of the Mesh. Thank you.